Uh oh, they're, they're running off to the left. They're running off to the left. This is what happened. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel today. I've got a special guest here who's gonna teach me how to do some P.E.K.K.A. Smash. I have Sammy of RVNT, and he has done P.E.K.K.A. Smash and leading them off in his wars. Welcome here, Sammy. I am so happy to learn P.E.K.K.A. Smash from you. How are you doing today? Hello, Carbon. I'm good. Thanks for the, the invitation here. <laughs> Yes, absolutely. I've done a video with XBB with Valkyries. If you want to check that out, a link down below. Let's go ahead and talk about a couple base designs and the thought process. So on this base right here, what do you want to do? Essentially, what is the goal of the P.E.K.K.A. Smash when you're planning an attack? So um, when I see a base, uh, the first thing I look is the CC. Mm -hmm. um, because uh, where I when I plan with the Smash, Mm -hmm. I normally try to do a queen charge before and then add the smash. But gotcha. the queen charge needs to be easy because uh, in uh, it's uh, uh, smash and not like queen charge Lalo. Mm -hmm. So the queen charge need to take uh, one minute and okay. maybe one or two rage and needs to be easy to be connected okay. with the smash after. So uh, and, just uh, just to ask a question on that is so your goal is to charge the queen in first and to get some high value and not pull out the clan castle right away? Is that kind of what you want to do? Yes, because if you take the clan castle with the queen charge, mm -hmm. it will take uh, a lot of time and you ah, will okay. do uh, time fail. Gotcha. So essentially you want to charge the queen into the eagle artillery like this. And then what's your goal yeah. after that? Where do you want to get that? So um, then I have to see if it's better smash from uh, um, seven or from ten. Okay. Um, or eleven. Uh, in this base, I think it is better from eleven because okay. there is the queen, the scatter, and the uh, multi very um, okay next to each other. Gotcha. So you can take them all out with the warden. Okay. And then I can use the jump on the back end to have a chest to everything. Okay. So essentially, you want to charge the queen in towards this eagle like this but then you do you is your goal to get the queen to loop back out and then join in with the pekka smash is that kind of the goal yeah. okay. yes to be in charge you want like the queen to go, in, to go inside and then mm -hmm. to go outside and okay and with the smash and go to the tunnel okay so what's the benefit of what do you use warden walks essentially or do you prefer to do the queen um, charge into the pekka? i use I use a lot more the queen charger because okay. uh, if you face like uh, Skelly and Teslas with mm -hmm. the queen, it's just better because you take okay. them out very early, but with gotcha. the warden can be a problem with the time. Okay. And uh, yeah, that's the main reason. Okay, so then you want to charge your Pekka Smash through the top side. Then you deal with the CC a little bit later. Then where do you want to jump the or drop the jump spell? Essentially, is it like you want to drop um, the jump over here to get yeah, access to yes. everything else? Okay. Yes. So, so all the jumps can go on the scatter and the inferno. Okay, and then you just have the town hall. If that stays up for for the end, or is that where the log launcher? helps to go all the way to the town hall. Is that essentially um, what you do? I think when the troops go in the core, I think the so something will uh, split on the town hall and something will split down. Okay. But it's uh, it's not a problem. Gotcha. Okay. And then where does your royal champion come in then? Um, I normally don't plan the, cha the royal champion okay. because I use it where the biggest group of troops left uh, is. Okay. But uh, I think on this base is better at three after okay. the, the king goes there gotcha so you want to kind of drop your royal champion later yeah. after that got it all right okay perfect let's go ahead and now give this a shot and see how it goes the queen at nine, and okay. the so how do you nine, how do you know if the queen's gonna okay so you wall break there got it. i was like there's open walls i'd be like i don't know how to get my queen to go in <laughs> okay <laughs> yeah all right, got it. So oh. now I use uh, the warden yeah. to speed the, the queen charger. To speed it up, okay, gotcha. And I I noticed that if you have the warden there, you're it's like a risk of the healers transferring to the warden. How do you not yeah. let that happen? Um, you have to make sure there is not that big uh, splash damage on the queen, okay. uh, which can uh, damage also the warden. Like okay. in this case, there is only a big inferno, so it's not a big problem. Okay. But uh, if there is like a scatter with 
his feet uh, in front of the window can, uh, can be a problem. Gotcha. Uh -huh. Right now, then with the log launcher, I try to snipe the the camera there. Yeah. So, now I start Got it. My smash. Okay, so I see you drop the golem echoes. Are the wizards really to help with like the CC that comes out, like a lava hound and things like that? Because you only have two of them. Uh, yeah, it's uh, for the for the lava hound. Gotcha. Okay. So okay. Yeah, we'll look at the... All right. Yeah, you got your bowler straight into the middle. There you go. Yeah. Okay. Rage for the two super wizards. Just take the down. Okay. Oh yeah. How man, your wizards are still alive. That's wild. That's crazy. <laughs> I don't know how yeah. you do it. Now look at that smash here. Okay. Now you're pushing your way through towards that single. A bowler super wizard smashing through. Even still have a king ability. Yeah, I normally try to uh, use the king ability for the back end because for the, okay, I, I so you try to save it. Time. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Now okay. the poison normally I can use it on the MCC. But okay. like in this case I can save it for I don't know the royal champions or the king. Okay. So you you try to save the poison spell for later in the rain, not necessarily on the CC. Yeah, because super wizards can take it out so quick. Yeah, and mm -hmm. normally there is a skellis on the back end if I face a best of hand. Okay. So it's very good for the royal champions to um, to save the, the poison for the scaly. Okay. So the royal champions in the back end will... Uh, wow, look at that. Uh, the challenge is I've got to try to put this to the test to see, if, see if I <laughs> can plan it and take it down. So let's go ahead and give it a shot now. All right, it's time for me to now plan on a base. In your attack, you charged into the Eagle Artillery. So if I try yeah. to do that here, the problem is there's going to be like the enemy queen and king and that's an issue because if we wanted to send a log launcher somewhere on this base, the best place probably would be through the Eagle, right? So, yeah. so then, also, yep. If you try to queen charge the eagle, mm -hmm. it's not easy because it's yeah. a longer queen charger and it's not easy to connect with the slash later. Yeah. So you want to charge like a small part of the base with the... Yeah, so essentially charging over to the right side, breaking the queen into the scatter, then try to break the queen back out and then loop the main push with the log launcher through the base to the town hall like this. It's essentially... Exactly. The kind of the smash and then the problem is we're gonna have this left side kind of up so we're gonna have to find a little bit so maybe this is where the king will come to the top side to help remove this section as the smash kind of pushes its way all the way to the town hall so okay so if i gotta get this queen to be deployed here i do need a baby dragon probably to funnel so i have five balloons so i go here maybe take this out Maybe drop a baby dragon over here. I don't know. Super wall break like this. I'm going to force the queen in. Okay. And then you said... Okay, let's go and drop the healers. And then warden. Should I drop the warden on ground here with her? I think as soon as you take down the scatter, okay. you can drop the warden. Okay. Because the scatter could damage my warden then is the reason? Yeah, sure. Okay, got it. All right. So, so you're sure your either doesn't switch on the world. Okay, that's a good, that's a very important point is to try, try your obviously best of not having those healers to switch. And I'm sure so many players has had that happen to them. <laughs> Absolutely. All right. <laughs> yeah. We got the enemy queen that, okay, we're going to have to rage her up. To take okay. her down. Got that. Oh, we got the king. Should I drop a head on her? Mm, or am I, I good? No, because it's no? fine. Okay. So now, so now I can probably drop a golem to the top side. Yeah. Maybe the king, some witches up there. And then, sure. should I wall break? Or no, I wall break by the scatter for the king. No, no, you can uh, wall break. Okay, I'll wall break then. Say so, let's do it. Perfect. Oh, king's going in. Oh, okay, king's yeah. not going to the top side. This is what happened. <laughs> It's not a problem, like, okay. out of time, like, you go inside the special. Okay. Gotcha. 
All right, so we're making our way through. Should I do an early warden ability, uh, or should I wait towards um, the town hall? This time, you should wait uh, to reach the core, because okay. there is the most damage there. Uh-oh. They're, they're running off to the left. They're running off it's to the like, left. It's fine. Okay. Now you can place the warden. Okay. You miss the warden. A warden ability. Perfect, perfect. Thank yeah. you. So you said you save. You can jump uh, on the golden. Jump so on the gold. Just to everything. Okay, I'm gonna jump there. Maybe that was the right spot. I'm probably not. Let's go oh, and freeze. Yeah, that's nice. That's single you can target. Use your warrior champions at nine. Okay. So you have, uh, Let's go ahead and freeze this. Town all goes down. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Oh, wait, look at this. This is not not too bad. We still have yeah. king ability. You said save the king ability for as late as possible. I only have 30 seconds. I'm about yeah, to probably no, raise to, RC up. You have to use it, yeah. Pop that king ability. Run, RC, run! Go, 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 go! <laughs> but with the <laughs> RC and rage, pop the RC ability. I think this will work. Look at that. Yeah. There we go. It works. That's very nice. But it is a very strong hit here. All right, we're going for the next tech. You can see he tripled, then I tripled on first try. And now we're going to hit a ring style base. And I asked him, what is the CC do you want to use, Sam? And you said a Siege Barracks would be better on this ring style base. Why is that? What's the what's the plan on a ring style? Because normally uh, what I try to do is um, or a um, Queen Charger when there isn't a CC. And okay. then I smash uh, with the Siege Barracks. Okay. And like something will go for the town or something will gotcha. go outside. Okay. And that's how to do or So essentially you're still keeping your queen charge away from the clan castle and where would you charge your queen then if you want to keep so her away the, from that cc yeah the cc is at six or mm -hmm. it's closer to six so i'm a queen charge at 12. okay to take the multi and okay. when where the queen will go left or right mm -hmm. i add the, the smash okay with the siege works outside gotcha and then uh, I just spend everything with the Okay. Goal. Okay, so and essentially, yeah. if you're looking at me trying to plan, are you going to try to drop the queen from like this right side, loop her up, and then wall break in? Is that your goal? Or are you mm -hmm. going to literally drop the queen at 12 to try to make in, your way in towards the multi? From 12 is better. Because okay. like, you can also use a wall break and more there. Okay. Then okay, so and you'll get your queen in. And then essentially, let's say the queen walks left. You'll drop a siege barracks over here to grab this stuff. And then this is where the, sp the smash will kind of try to join in to move its way around. And then you could use a jump to bring him back for the town hall, essentially. Yeah, sure. Grab that. Okay. All right. All right. Um, I waited to use the warden before I take down the multi. Okay. Because so... you don't want the healers to switch to the warden. Got it. Okay. Let's see. Queen's going in. Mm -hmm. Those expos could be quite a pain. <laughs> yeah. Nice. So now the queen should go on the left. Okay. My queen would like okay, walk no. backwards and not go anywhere I want. Oh, where's she going? Is she going right? Yeah, it's going right. Oh, she's going right. Side. Okay, see? <laughs> she's going everywhere. Okay, all right. Well, going in the siege works, which is going to the smash. Gotcha. Jump there. And the so the order is... that you drop your troops is golems, pekkas, balloons to pull, seeking air mines, and then bowlers last then, behind yeah. everything? Okay. Yeah, the golem is first to put back yep. the, the eagle. Okay. The, the rooms is good if you are joining, like if you are enter in a multi compartment, it's good to tank. Uh, okay. The, to do the, the, it's good to tank the super wizard. The okay. Yeah. There's a multi. That's what it was. Okay. I see, I see. So now, rage on the ear. Nice rage. Look at them just making their way through it. And, and they, those those witches down south, especially with a single being down there, uh, that yeah, can get distracted. Very good. And then I see so, you're saving yeah. that king ability for later. Make yeah. beautiful. Oh, look now at that. 
see. It's and, there. Uh, man, you make it look so easy. <laughs> <laughs> oh the my fact goodness. is that uh, it's not that hard if you, if you practice a bit. Okay. Yeah. Well, I mean, you you do it all the time. Yeah, I mean, this is the exact <laughs> year. So I'm going to give one more base a try as we've been tripling, tripling, tripling all these. And we'll try to see if I can come up with one final plan to get a three star with a spec smack. Okay, Sam, you've given me this box base and I told you I don't want any help here. I don't want any input. I'm going to plan it. If it fails, then I will try to fix it and learn from my fail. So the plan is... This one is going to go with a warden walk. So I'm going to go with a warden walk off to this right side. So I want to clear this section here to grab this maybe with my warden walk. And then I ha can wall break into this uh, air defense. Maybe try to wall break again so that I can get the smash to move through here with the P.E.K.K.A.s, the golem, the bowlers like this. Then I could drop the king to kind of run this way with a siege barracks on the far left side to run over here, do something, who knows? Uh, <laughs> that's probably not good planning, but just let him go. <laughs> and then I'm gonna drop the jump spell, maybe like this to connect to the town hall, to push my way through to the town hall, and then just drop the Royal Champion later, maybe, uh, maybe to the top side, maybe to the left side, and to go across. Do, what, do you think that might look good, or you would do something totally mm -hmm. different, right? Uh it's different from what I from what you do. do. Okay. But, uh, well, maybe it can work. Maybe it can work. Okay, so I want to learn. I want to know what you would do after me because I this is probably not going to go yeah. well. So this is how I learn, right? <laughs> I want to know what I would do compared to what you would do, and maybe they both work. Who knows? So yeah. let's go with a little warden walk because I just don't know how to charge a queen like you do. So I'm going to do the safer route. So I'm going to go with. Uh, the uh, healer? The yeah, healer. Well tip for Warden Walk. If there what? is not too much damage, you can use like two or three healers and then the others for directly on the smash here. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. You don't have any risk. Yep, that's what I'm doing here. So, yeah, perfect. We're gonna go. Let's see, we got a baby dragon. Maybe I could try a baby dragon there onto that cannon. Okay. So that looks fine. We're gonna go with a. Uh, a golem, a P.E.K.K.A. P.E.K.K.A. Some super wizards, queen, uh, king here, boom, some witches, some bowlers, four healers, some balloons, and then drop the jump leading towards here. Ah, scatter! Oh! Okay, where's my king going? Come back around. Okay, right. it's fine, as long as you can go. Okay, where where are my bowlers? Where are my Pekka's going? Pekka's, you gotta go for the jump! Hold on, yeah, hold on. No, you, you need to use the person because it's... Um, okay, I'm gonna use the that. King's ability. Okay, I'm trying to push my way through. My bowlers are all gone. Bowlers, where did you go? Oh no, oh no. Wait a sec, can I keep them alive? Freeze you up. I got a raw champ. I'm going all out. RC's going in. Queen, where are you going? Can you rage the queen? Let's rage the so queen, yeah. The word, okay. It's gonna freeze the town hall. RC, yeah. the ability's forced. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, RC's died. Mm. Oh, oh, wait, queen, where are you going? She's going for the skellies. And RC's dead. Oh! Pop the queen ability. Oh! I should have raged. Yep, you're right. I'm I'm looking at all this stuff. Queen doesn't even take the down. Oh no, no! <laughs> I could have used the rage there. Well, okay. Yeah. Well, box bases are not for me. So um, obviously you were like, this is not the way to to hit this base here. I've got to yeah. learn. So uh, now I want to learn how you would do it. And this is why I want to. This is the whole point of trying to say, okay, that's not the right way to hit it. And as it's a one star, right? It's risking to pushing everything through. So now let's learn exactly how you would hit this space and what the proper way of hitting this box space. Okay, let's jump into that now. Anyway, on box spaces, okay. I never um, entry for one of the scatter. I always go opposite 
Oh, oh. see. So okay, and that would have been good to know. So you never enter into one of the scatters. Yeah. It's oh, uh, just it. don't work. <laughs> well, yeah. that's that's then, problem number one. Okay, got it. Don't enter from scatters yeah. and box spaces. Okay. Okay, so you um, would blimp the scatter. The queen. You queen charge from three. Okay. Uh, no, sorry, from uh, six. Uh, from um, six, okay. Yeah. Then it will go on the multi, and then you can smash from... Uh, then from eight with the wall okay. breaker on the RC platform, mm -hmm. you can jump on the expert to have access to the town hall and send the RC on the eagle to the core to okay. take um, all, uh, all okay, the. Okay, so the RC would come works. later for the for the eagle as the smash yeah. comes through like this. Ah, okay. Got yeah. it. All right, let's see what and happens. This... So, in general, you would say usually never send a P.E.K.K.A. Smash into a scatter shot. That's kind of a big rule, yeah. right? Okay, yeah, that's, that's good to know. Rule. That is definitely good to know because that is not what I... That I sent it right into the scatter and you were like, that's, don't do that! <laughs> you were probably in your head <laughs> screaming at me! Oh, my. Yeah. Oh, boy. Okay, so, see, this uh, is why I gotta learn. Bit, okay. Yeah. Just need to okay. charge the multi. Got it. Drop some archer from 3 and 12. Because okay. there is a lot of uh, free units. Now, some cocoon. Yep, free archers at uh, free sp uh, defense or buildings at 3 and 12 with your archers. Yeah. Okay, nice. Now, dealers should switch from the cocoon. Okay. Is, uh, not switching, which is oh. the, it's not the best thing, but Healers! Go to the Queen! <laughs> oh my. So I... let's start. Go to the bear. Queen's taking quite a bit of damage, but she's fine here. Okay. okay. Well, the didn't work, but it's Oh! Fine. Yeah, one more wall break. One more! That's why you got three of them. <laughs> there you the go, you broke through. For, uh, for Smash, it's always to have a... Uh, one ball breaker more that you need. So okay. if something goes wrong, gotcha. you can, uh, you can have an extra, it. yeah. So so essentially you said have what to always take one extra wall breaker than you think you need. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. So wow, look at this. This is way better than my attack. Because my attack starts splitting in every direction, but you created a beautiful funnel to push them right around. Incredible. Man, you make this look so easy. I was thinking like, okay, I don't know. I'm, I've got to think what to do. Maybe do a warden walk, do this. But this this made the, the attack look simple. Oh yeah, my god. This way to do the box spaces are really strong, but yeah. no one do that. Yeah. But, um, if you can um, understand how to do it, it's very strong because yeah. you want to this, uh, Absolutely. This you know exactly how to do it. I 100% learned a lot of don't go into a scatter shot, go away from the CC if possible, send log launchers on those anti three star designs, and then even use the siege barracks. And also, the big thing you don't use a flame flinger. Absolutely incredible. Yeah. Thank you so much, Sammy, for taking the time to sit down with me, help teach me Pekka Smash, and all the viewers at home. Was there anything uh, else you wanted to say before we wrap up this video? Um, let's try to strategy, guys, because it's very strong and funny. Yes. Uh, yeah, that's all. Cool. Awesome. Well, thank you so much again, Sammy, for joining me. Remember, guys, if you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. Hit that like button and subscribe down below. See you guys next time.